Hello everyone, this video is a status update, but it's not really scripted, so I'll just say whatever comes to me. So, I recently I haven't been making uh, too much, too many videos, and they haven't been the greatest videos either, so, sorry for that guys, I haven't been really buying too much cubes like I used to, I've been spending my money on other things games but um don't worry i started buying cubes again and i have two cubes on the way one from light take which i don't like buying from light takes take forever but to make a long story short i just thought that the cube that i was buying from light take was only sold on light take or the hk now store so i picked light take but i was wrong it's also sold in the american stores that would be a surprise unboxing and the other cube i bought bought was the Alpha CC pre-order from iCubeMart.com and that's going to come in about four weeks approximately. So, and I'm thinking about buying um, something from SpeedCubeShop.com. Another surprise, I guess. So, stay tuned. I will be doing unboxings and reviews. Okay, so before I go on with this video, let me do a quick shout out to Pancakes zero zero one let me just make sure that's the name of his channel right pancakes zero zero one or pancakes double oh one his description will be in the his channel will be in the description below he's an awesome cool dude i met him at the houston open 2011 he's really cool subscribe to him guys support him he's a really cool guy like i said a bajillion times yeah awesome cool guy subscribe to him like i said a bajillion times but um I needed to sh make a shout out to about two other people and I can't remember so if you guys are watching comment below to remind me to do a shout out for you guys also I just can't remember who I needed to do a shout out also for so yeah guys just comment below if you're watching this video okay so last Saturday I believe which May 21st of this year I went to the Houston Open 2011 and it was it was a bunch of fun I competed in 2x2. Two two. I used my White Landland 2x2. Two two. I competed in 3x3. Three three. I used my Black Guhong 3x3. Three three. And I competed in 4x4. Four four. This thing disappointed me. This is my Ghost Stand, Ghost Stand 2. Uh, Ghost Stand 2 4x4. Four four. This is the same thing as a Shang Sha, basically. Basically the same thing. Not much difference at all. Um. The first solve on this thing popped on me, like just straight up exploded. Because all along when I was using the thing, it would not pop and not really explode. And then the night before the competition, I decided to lube it. Bad idea. Don't ever lube your Shen Xiao with Lubix or your Ghost Stand 2 4x4. It will just make it explode. So my new main is this. Maru 4x4. It will never explode on me on a competition. Okay. Also at the competition, I traded some of my cubes, so sadly some cubes in my collection aren't there anymore. Like maybe four cubes from my collection are not in my collection anymore, like my V-Cube 5, my A5F, or my Alpha 5F, my Ghost Stand 2x2, and I'm probably missing one more cube. Yeah, no, those are just those are just those three. I did trade my Alpha Memory, but I have an Alpha Five. I have two Alpha Fives, so I could just easily make those in a memory if I wanted to. Okay, so these are the cubes I got with the, some trades and and yeah. So I got this Cube Twist two by two. It's cool. Comment below if you want a review on that. And I got a Landline four by four. It's somewhere in my cubes pile of pile of mountain cubes I, yeah I can't find it right now but I, I just don't want to look for it if you want to review on that also my landline 4x4 just post a comment uh, what else? I didn't win anything at the competition I am not that fast but if they had magic as an event I would win because I I'm pretty good in magic my record in magic is 1.31 now I know I'm not as fast as Drum God 1997, 
but I probably will get there one one day. Who knows? Okay, and um, I don't. I think that is it. See what happens when you don't script things. You don't know if it's the end of your video or not. Uh, I want a new main three by three. I mean, I've been using this glue on for almost a year. It's probably been eight months now. I'm tired of just using only it because the MF8 Legend is not my main. It's not that great. The Ling Yang or Ling Yon, however you pronounce it, it's just not that great as a Goo Hong. And this cube that I'm mad at, the Lun Hoi or whatever you say it, where it has these pieces like that. Wait, let me just try to get it to focus. Oh, I can't use can't even do it right. I don't know if you guys can see that or not. What a disappointment. I don't want a cube that's this slow. Well, it's not really slow, it's control speed, but I don't I don't like that too much. So yeah, I'm looking for a main speed cube besides a Guhong, because I've been using that so long. I just kinda I'm hoping this new Alpha CC is good enough for me to want to use it as my main. So yeah, um, I guess that's the end of my video, but um, I guess since these are in my video, I, might sh I just want to show them. I love goldfish. I like, um, I've never actually tried this flavor before, I don't think, the wild white, wild, wild white cheddar. I'm going to give this a try, but I like goldfish. And the, uh, like, this is basically the original goldfish, kind of. So yeah, the regular goldfish. So yeah, I guess that's all for my video. I don't know if I'm missing anything, but sorry I haven't been making more videos, and I will improve that. Especially, well, I'm in summer school, but I was about to say especially since it's summer, but I'm in summer school, so I'm still in school. But I will be making more videos and more unboxings and more reviews. If you guys have a cube you want to suggest me buying, um, go ahead and comment below. Thanks, guys, for watching. Bye.